is up YouTube, Lazy Lama here, and here we are back with some more Clicker Heroes once more. Um, oh, okay, that's great. That's absolutely fantastic. I'm actually going to skip out on that. We're going to go on this because we're going to be time lapsing here in a minute. Um, I'd rather have that done. Did I do the raid today? Nah, let's get that done. Make sure I get it done. I prefer to do it on the first bit when it first comes out rather than trying to do it on the following day. Um, sometimes I will miss it by like an hour depending on how things go. I think I will, I will only miss it once since I've been back in um, Lamination. But uh, yeah, it's something to keep up on. I didn't point this out before. I think we've done a video where we've been in it, but we're 30k immortal level, which is pretty sweet. Uh, I do want to point out we are doing a giveaway. Um, I will explain more a little bit later in the video um, around when we do all the... Uh, the comments of the day stuff but got a bunch of codes to give out so I'll go over that in a little bit more detail in a bit uh, but let's I, I, what am I trying to do we're not progressing um what, what was I thinking I was gonna progress after that let's just ascend let's go let's get things rolling bam boom Let's go. If you guys haven't noticed by the way, I have a new Click Hero series going on. It's a No Transcending Challenge. Um, make sure to check it out. It's kind of cool. It's pretty cool. A couple episodes in, I've been having some fun messing around on it, doing the early game of Click Your Heroes again. It's so slow. It's, it's crazy on how things change in this game uh, and how drastic they change. It's not even a small change. It's just this game drastically changes when it comes to that. Um, quickly come in here I do a quick save I, I don't know why I always put those down before I do this shoot this first because we got to get the um, ancients updated do a beautiful auto level bada bing bada boom which I've been trusting this has been actually working pretty well I haven't had any issues again I've only ever had issues once whoops um, yeah, that would have been great uh, import I don't know why I exit out of it We'll reimport that there. And then I will get these placed. Um, is that all of them? Yeah, it is. Cool. Throw this here. Um, oh, look at this. We are starting back in Kadu, which is pretty sweet. Um, it's actually pretty hype. Um, I want to verify that these are correct. Uh, yep, that's good. Just check one down here. I don't think it wouldn't be, but yeah, no, we're good. Everything looks fine. Uh, get another save in for the top mass calculator as it may have changed slightly with changing over to Cadu. I doubt it. Um, yeah, the week and then 248s. 24 and 28s. And we're not going to obviously do all that. Someone um, suggested, and it's a valid point, um, that I, because I'm not doing so many super large amount of ascensions each week anyways, I could kind of get away with... Um, not using any time lapses, but to build up mercs, you kind of need your time lapses. That's how I've always built my mercs up. It's how the series has continued on the way it has anyways. Um, so I'm going to kind of continue doing things the way I'm doing. Um, we might take it a little more chill. because I've been skipping like the last 8 hour ones normally. We might even skip the 24 hour, or maybe even a 48 this week. Cause, eh, like I'm going to tone in and out. It's going to kind of depend on how mercs are going. Um, probably didn't even need to move those as per usual, but uh, it's okay. Let's just do it. Let's get this in. Rubies. Mm, eh, eh. Um, I gotta watch rubies for you guys, though. Um, basically, what's going on with this giveaway is I've got 10 codes, so there's gonna be 10 winners. Um, I'm gonna be selecting you guys just from leaving a comment. All you gotta do is like, a, like the video, leave a comment. Um, it'll only count for one time if you comment. If you comment multiple times, it's okay. It just It's only gonna give you still one count towards the thing, and I'll do the... Uh, we'll do a video and about a week or so it'll be next week sometime so it won't even be a full week um it's not going to be like next video it's going to be its own video where i'll go over the winners but just leave a comment of sorts um say you know what's up i'll be confirming things through discord um that's basically how you will confirm who you are and whatnot so when i kind of go over the video you'll have to reach out to me and i will then go through a couple verification things to verify you are who you say you are because uh, we've had some people try to take some people's rubies before which um, we've caught because i've always been very cautious of it so that's all you got to do to enter the giveaway very simple same as always um they are 100 ruby codes and there are 10 of them you can only win once um obviously it makes sense you can only win once but uh yeah i thought it'd be something cool uh, it's kind of for our 10k uh subs owned as a youtube's um kind of something little for clicker heroes um 
the devs were kind enough to hook me up. Ah, oh, we didn't even get that. Wow, that's so upsetting. Um, they're kind enough to hook me up with the codes to um, give out to you guys. I'll do the 24 there. I guess we're just gonna do 48 hour. Like this is this is rough. Um, all right, we're hanging on by a thread. <laughs> we're hanging on by a thread. But yeah, if the winners do not claim the rubies, basically I'll be uh, just re-picking them down the line. We're gonna do one more. We're gonna do the both 48s, and then we'll probably just call it. I'm not gonna do the 24 just because this is this is rough. We're in some bad shape. I was hoping maybe we got some new new good good mercs. Um, we'll send him out on this just for the 24 hour, and then I'll try to be a little more cautious sending him out on rubies, even though I don't normally get cautious with them that quick. Um, we're gonna have to do it. Um, yeah, we're ready to go, right? Yeah. We're ready to roll. Let's do it. It's so sad running so low on rubies. It's so sad. We've, we've had so many at one point. I remember the days I was sitting at like almost 5k rubies. Actually, I think it was only like almost 4k. It was 3. Three something, I believe. Wasn't anything actually absolutely insane. Um, but yeah, we're at the point where we're gonna do a 24 and then two eights. I think I'm just gonna chill. I think I'm just gonna chill. I'm not in a super rush with that. But um, yeah, again, remember, get in that Ruby code um, or get in that Ruby entry, the giveaway entry, whatever you want to call it. Um, make sure to do so. Make sure to do so. Hook you guys up. I know there's a lot of new players lately, so. That'd be kind of a cool little thing for you guys too, because I know there's a bunch of new people that could definitely use it. Man, I, they're not worth reviving for me. Like I could revive them and risk it, but if they don't have any kind of like, weren't anything good anyways, I'm not gonna do it. I'm just not gonna. Sure, whatever. Just go level up. You're level one. I don't really care what you go do. Get levels. All right, um, I'm gonna bounce out here. I'm gonna get over to the comments of the day, and uh, we'll go from there. All right, so it looks like I pulled four comments of the day. Not too many this week. Um, I'm not sure why I only pulled four. It was a while ago when I pulled them, um, but popping into things. Coming in from Oof. What's up, Oof? Oof's a very big, popular, I guess you could say, <laughs> member of the Discord. Been around for quite some time, hanging around. He pops in the streams a lot, too. But uh, Oof, coming in with the hashtag, comment of the day. It's all you gotta do to get in these. Um, would you go about using the Merc Lister so you can try to get good Mercs? Uh, I prefer to not use the Merc Lister. I've never used it on this account. I've used it and messed with it like on other accounts before. I like the surprise of this account. Um, I don't even want to call it like cheatsy because like we accept it in the clans and stuff. Like it's it makes sense. It's you know kind of the same thing as using a calculator in that sense. Um, about you know being able to see when your Mercs are gonna die, what Mercs are coming, and such. And just, I don't want to. And I'm going to hold through. I've gone this long. I would be in such a better place right now if I did use it. I understand that because I've had some pretty good luck. And if I could help control that luck with what I send on what, uh, we'd be in a better spot for sure. But because um, I know when I have to be careful on things and when I don't, etc. But uh, yeah, I'm going to say no. I would not use it. I'm not. Worst comes to worst, we get down and I do a little update. I, you know, try to get as far as I can in Ascension. And uh, we mainly go through the comments of the day and go over all the clan info. That'll be a progress each week. Again, one of the other reasons I kind of have this other Click Heroes series going on is just to get, you know, more Click Heroes content on the channel to kind of make up for um, my lack of actual progress in this because it just takes forever to get back to where we're going. Um, comment of the, uh, coming in next comment, uh, Nick Cha. Welcome, welcome. Uh, but coming in with uh, hashtag comment of the day, will you make a clan for Ascendant Llama? Um, no. Uh, I don't plan to do any Ascendant Llama Clan. Uh, there's not a huge reason for it. I do have a Patreon Clan now. Uh, I thought that would be a fun little perk uh, for the Patreons, but I'm not planning on doing any Ascendant Llama Clan. A lot of Ascendant Llamas honestly stop playing. Um, they get up to about a mil and then just call it quits, as a mil is what brings you into the late game. I mean, you got early game, which is about one to 200k, uh, mid game, which is about 200k to... Um, one mil or so and then late game happens and it's pretty much what i'm doing forever for the rest of the game so a lot of people bounce out there which is a solid point to kind of bounce out of the game um it's kind of like the most respectable point to to stop playing i mean you know i, I consider you can consider it's not beating the game but you can sit, consider yourself satisfied with your your progress at that point um so that's just a lap to a lot of these anyways 
So I don't think there's a huge need for it. Uh, but honestly, at that point, you're better off just getting in your own clan and just boosting up your own boss. Like, you don't need anyone in your clan. The clans, honestly, are pointless other than help new players anyways. That's really the point of the clans. Uh, Ashtag comment of the day from Gino. What's up, Jin? How's it going, buddy? It's been a while since I've heard from you, man. Hopefully, you uh, pop around in the streams, come hang out a little bit more, dude. I miss you, dude. I miss you. But uh, coming in, are there any series coming back that have been gone for a while? Like Time Warpers, for instance. Is that a hint that you want Time Warpers? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Uh, well, the Click Your Heroes series came back. <laughs> so that's, that's a, I guess, a game that hasn't really gone away, but it's come back. Uh, Click Your Heroes 2 will be back when the next big update hits, which... Um, I tried to get info um, from the devs when I was talking to them, and they could not give me a complete date yet. Uh, they didn't want to tell me a date and then it'd be wrong. Um, but when that comes out, um, I was told soon. Um, I plan to play that, and we'll probably do some maybe YouTube streams on it and stuff as well. Hang around on that, and that'll be when I'll actually continue through, hopefully. I think there will be enough going on with offline progression um, where it's like where I want to actually sit and play the game. And we'll go, it'll be a long series, hopefully, just like this one. Uh, and there is another game that I've talked about on and off in videos where I might replay through Adventure Capitalist. Uh, it was kind of a fun one. Um, it was actually definitely a fun one. It was, I think, one of the first. I think it was the first idle game that I started getting back, like when I, when I got back into YouTube, like three years ago. Um, I think that was. I think I started that right before I started. I may have started Adventure Communist first. I can't remember if it was Adventure Capitals or Adventure Communist. They were started around the same time. Same thing with Click Heroes. They're all like together. Um, but I might bring that back. Um, people were saying play the mobile version. I don't think I'm going to do that. I'm going to play the, the Steam version because it's just as up to, date, up to date. They continue to support that. If I'm not mistaken, uh, I will verify that before I do it. But I'd rather play it on Steam uh, as it just comes out and looks better for the video. Uh, but that, Time Warpers. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't have plans for it, but maybe, I don't want to say it's not, I, I'm never going to say a series will never come back, I mean I might say a series will never come back, but I'm not going to say that about that series if that's what you're trying to ask for. Um, and last comment coming in from uh, Sharir, Com hashtag comment of the day, if someone gave you 10,000 smackaroonies, basically money, would you start Click Your Heroes all over again? So wait, are you asking if I, if, if someone were to like be like, here, here's ten thousand dollars, like delete my save and start over? I mean, yeah, I mean, I would. As sad as it would be, we would do it. I mean, think about it. I'm, I'm literally putting myself through the most torturous thing I, you know, <laughs> like going on right now. With there's no, no transcending challenge in that other series. Um, yeah, yeah. I mean, I would, I would. I mean, yeah. You say basically money. Is is it money? Is is it actually money? Like, like. 10,000 US dollars? Yeah, I mean, of course, dude. Um, that, that's an absurd amount of money to re lose data in a video game. Uh, I would definitely do it. I'm sure a lot of people would be happy about it. <laughs> They'd love to see an actual playthrough. Because like, there'd be more going on in an actual playthrough than what I'm doing now. I mean, again, once you break the one mil mark, it's just the game just gets so slow. Absolutely slow. Um, which isn't terrible. Oh, please do this. That'll be a nice level 9. I believe. I believe. Don't really care. Get rid of all you guys. Um, and let's hop over to the clan info. Hopping in with Lamination. Pretty sure I got all this right. I actually did it this week as I did some updates. And there's even some more updates coming either next week or the week after. I might even make a whole new chart system. So I'm pretty excited about that. I'm not positive yet. But, uh... Um... One minute. Did I mark... <laughs> I'm already second-guessing myself. I can't just yell at Toasty this week. So I have to make sure I did it right. I either didn't mark this dude as safe, and it, yeah, okay, that was uh, that was my fault. I was just marking someone. It wasn't it wasn't any of my um my info input though. All right, cool. So we've got busy going up 6.3k. Congrats, uh, Prez with the. Uh, I, just, I lost my lost my space with my recording software. Uh, Prez going up 17,000 zones. Congrats to you. Breaking that 50k mark. Ghosty with the 10k leap. Um, getting pretty close to 40k. Um, Turbski. Yo, what's up, man? Uh, <laughs> I love your Dave, dude. Uh, coming in at 14k. Almost doubling your zones, man. Nice. Breaking the 30k mark as well. Zacky G, welcome to the clan. Coming in at 10... 644. Not bad, man. Not bad. Hopefully a week or two and you'll be smashing that 20k mark. We got uh, 
Byro with the 3k jump. Really close. A thousand zones off of 10k. And then Mason. Welcome to the clan. Coming in at 2100. Lamination 2. We got Chunky. Going up only 7500 zones. Not much, but I'm pretty sure he's just, you know, out of rubies. Kind of pushing through the brother grind kind of deal. Um, or at least taking it slow, conserving rubies. If he's not out, just trying to conserve rubies. Um, hopefully you can get through your grind, my dude. Uh, the bird is the word. Going up 24,000 zones. Not bad, Matt. Friend. Uh, we got Tikaog. Going up 1,800. Breaking that 10k mark. Uh, Joey. Going up 2,500, dude. Massive leaps from where you were. Congrats. And then Rack coming into the clan. Welcome at... Uh, coming at 352 and then there's an open spot at the current time that's recording um, I some of these clans have open spots because I hijacked um, people out of them <laughs> I kidnapped them the patreons I took um, all the current active patreons I'm pretty sure all of them I've moved uh, over to the patreon clan and there's a couple of, I know there's one Eterpsky is gonna be a patreon coming in next month I believe um, so he you are gonna be more than welcome to move if you want it'll free up that spot for someone else um, when the next month comes and uh, you won't be kicked at 500k in the Patreon clan. You can, you can kind of be in the Patreon clan forever, uh, as long as you're obviously still playing. Uh, but uh, yeah, yeah. Now, Lamination three, we've got Oof going up 21,000. So freaking that 400k. Congrats to you, man. Less than 100k left. Do it up. Nornok with the 25k jump. Pretty big jumpage. Um, Zier. 50k jump, literally doubling his zones, breaking the 100k mark, congrats, big leaps dude, love to see it, Jazzy with a 12k, breaking 37,000, nice, Theptic coming into the clan at 29,000, welcome, uh, Flavored Water, uh, 6.7k, not bad, I was trying to judge, judge you on that, 6.7k, not bad, and there's an open space currently at the time of supporting, might be filled up by now, um, remember to Join the Discord and read how to join the clans. People do it wrong all the time. I had a spot open all week. I didn't feel it till literally the day of this recording. All week, constant declining people because they didn't follow the rules. Again, granted, they could just be random people. Um, not actually that watch the videos, but just it's so simple. Just go do it. Sorry, I have to keep coming out, tapping out, and grabbing the fish. Join the Discord. Read how to join. It's very easy. Llama Empire, we got Metroid with a 255,000 jump, just shy of that million. Congrats. Um, FG with the 33,000 jump, getting pretty close to 300k. Mathis coming in here with the 1500 jump, nothing crazy there, uh, but definitely crawling towards that 20k mark. Basti with 2300. We got Devocore with 1700. Not bad, not bad. Getting pretty close to 3k. Uh, a couple new members coming here. Uh, Anexus? Is that right? Maybe? I don't know. But coming in at 2300. And then Cosmic coming in at 1200. Welcome. And then open spot. You can see all three of them have open spots because I've kidnapped people. And one of them just didn't fill their spots. I'm pretty sure just one of them didn't fill their spots. Or I kidnapped all of them. No, because I only kidnapped two people. I'm trying to think of why one of them doesn't have a spot. Toasty should have. No, he had Torchic. I don't know. Was it Lamination 2 that messed up and didn't fill a spot? One of them slacked and didn't fill a spot, I think. But maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um... And then we got Llama Patronage, the new Patreon clan. Where we got Zach coming back into the clan. Uh, I marked him down for zero last week because he wasn't in the clans last week. So coming in at 1,079,194. Congrats, dude. Bringing us in massive for the clan charts. <laughs> um, Torchic uh, going up 354,000. Breaking that Ascendant Llama. Um, he would have been getting kicked this week. Anyways, so it's kind of worked out well for him. You get to kind of pop over to Lama Patronage uh, a little early. And then Sebi with the 3600 jump. And then the Lama No Transcend is my other account. Um, we're coming in at 88, I guess you could say. That's me. 
That's me. That's going to be a very slow grind. I'm gonna, I decided I wanted to include it. I was going to keep it out of these, but I decided it'd be kind of cool to include it. Uh, and then, lastly, coming on over to the clan chart, we're going to see... It just this week, while it bounces out, it's dominated by Llama uh, patronage. Um, just because of... I mean, most of it because of Zack coming back. But, uh... Zack is back. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but, uh, also, Torchic moved up quite a bit, too. So, kind of pulled that up. But, uh... They moved up a ton. I will go over everyone else, though. Llama Empire with a pretty hefty jump, too, mostly because of Metroid. But going up about 300,000. Llama Nation 3 with about half that at 150k. Um, Llama Nation 2 with 36,000. And Llama Nation with 63,000. Our clan total is now above 13,000 or 13 million which is pretty cool we're gonna actually see that continue up because we've got you know big dogs that are gonna be staying in the patreon clan um so we're gonna we're gonna be noticeably climbing more which is kind of neat but um anyways that's gonna conclude it for this episode guys i hope you guys did enjoy if so please take a second smack the like button remember simple hashtag comment of the day get in there um if you even do a hashtag comment of the day you get in for the giveaway that's i mean it's just simple as that you, you can get in just like that and i'll be doing the drawings i'm not sure what date yet but um Probably th Wednesday, Thursday. Maybe Thursday-ish. I don't know. It might make it all the way to next weekend. Um, but as long as you get in within like three days of this video releasing, you'll like 100% have a chance to win. Because uh, I definitely will not record the drawing before that. And as always, guys, I will catch you in the next one. Peace.